I was raised in a traditional setting where I kind of thought it was all or nothing. I thought you gave your life to your career or you stayed home and you were a stay-at-home mom and I really wanted something in the middle ground. I got to a point in my life when kids arrived that I felt torn and so I was forced to back away from a traditional schedule due to my ideals of being a present parent and so I did have to choose and when independent contracting fell into my lap I realized it would give me the flexibility that I desire to have and work while being present with my family. It's allowed us to live life on our terms and it's also allowed my husband to have that luxury as well. I ask legislation to pause and look at this because this would actually be detrimental to my family. With the job I had prior to this, I wouldn't have been able to do any of the things I'm doing currently as a parent. I would have had to have somebody take my kid to school, somebody pick my kid up from school. So I wouldn't have been able to volunteer. I wouldn't be able to, you know, be the soccer coach and be at dance classes, um, the gymnastics. My kids would have a good life, but it would have been a different life. I don't think there's a wrong way or a right way. I think having the choice is what is important. And I love that our family has that choice. So if it was passed, he would have to go back to work. And then I would have to go back to work. And then my children would be in daycare. And that's not bad. It's just not what we have pictured for our family and how we're raising them. So I'm beyond concerned. When I first heard about this, I pretty much had my jaw hit the floor because our life would just kind of be swept out from underneath us. Here we are creating a very uh, quality of life that I would never want to shift back to what I did have. This is working for us that didn't.